so today we are at the boys last race of the season we're just checking out the track and uh, yeah already going at a pretty good pace and uh, i'm not racing today because i'm already warming up for next year and uh, yeah so this is just a day for the boys and uh, it's the last race of the season and we are here in Tobol Svenja Baga which has made trail to us about so I can go watch the trails and uh, yeah it's gonna be exciting to see how they're gonna do it and uh, yeah it's a beautiful and a really nice track really nice trail so it's gonna be exciting to see how they're gonna go and then uh, woo ah, this look at it I hate this last corner the trail with this if you're watching please fix that corner it's just going from the most insane berm to the most insane off camera and it's most likely with please please fix that that would be nice so we're uh, just down on the way to the start of the race and I'm just gonna take some videos of the boys and uh, it's a long way and they're going up all the big hills so it's gonna be interesting how they're gonna fare against all the other guys so uh, I think it will fail them a little bit because they're not that big so uh, yeah you can probably see <laughs> you can look all the way out to the ocean from here <laughs> so uh, yeah it's gonna be a fun day, at least for me, because I'm gonna to spectate today. And uh, yeah, it's the last race of the year for the boys. And after this, we're just gonna continue with the Swiss training. Wow! Way En god startposition, eller hvad? Yeah, yeah. You can godt se det, at... Uh... Hello, YouTube! So we can see, we have, they have started down the hill now. They're coming up. And uh, the other guys are down there. And uh, yeah, it's a really long hill. We're only, I don't know, halfway. Maybe a little over. Can't even see the top from here. And we have Jonathan in second position. Morden in about fifth. Kasse Dage! Okay, that's the one ten. As a Morden, Oliver. To be honest, I'm really happy not to be the one who has to go up this hill right now. So now we have Gustav and his group, he is second wheel. You can see him right there on the Nino Scott's back. And uh, he's just behind the first guy. Uh, unfortunately, I don't know his name, but uh, yeah, they have already established quite a big gap. Gotcha, Gustav! Gotcha, gotcha, dang. That's one big hill. And the rest of the field here. So now I'm just catching up with the boys going into the main track. And it's starting to rain now, which is not optimal. And uh, yeah, I can confirm that even though I'm not going at race pace, that this hill, even though it's not even finished yet, is pretty hard. I've just gone down the red trail and uh, oh. And uh, yeah, you can probably see it coming down right here. And this is the blue trail where they will come in uh, a little bit of time. I don't know. <laughs> so I think I will be able to hear them when they're coming. And uh, I just park my bike to the side. So if someone comes down this section, I'll be able to jump. 
Jeg har kørt, drenge. Og så Oliver. So, uh, I had to be pretty quick right there because they came out of nowhere. None of the brakes had any sound, so. Og så Jonathan. Og så Morten. Og så Jonathan, og så Morten. It's actually a really nice spot standing here. We get the view of the riders like two or three places. So uh, I think we have Ghost Star coming and yeah, in no time. And uh, he was just in the third start group, I believe. And uh, yeah, the other guys went the front group. So uh, I think there was about a minute between each group. So they can't be long before he comes. Ghost Star. Ja, Gustav. Det er nu alle Swift-træningen kommer. Og så godt kørt. Kom til Jonathan. Godt kørt. Kom til Jonathan. Kom til Jonathan. Er det vigtigt? Kom til Morten. Kom til Morten. Jeg har tre sekunder op til Jonathan. Kom til Jonathan. Kom til Morten. Godt kørt, Jonathan, lige der. Og så Gustav. Godt kæmpet. Og så Gustav. Mega godt kæmpet. Det er fandme godt kørt, det der. Kom så, drenge. I sidste omgang. Yeah, let's get it. Alright, so the last lap now. So it's the last lap now, and uh, I've just found a place to stand. I don't know when the guys is co when the guys are coming, and uh, yeah, I hope uh, that it's a great view from here. They're just coming from there and riding around here. So, go so drag it. Sixth lap gang. The family got cut. Go so. So, uh, yeah, that's going to be really wild to see who's going to win out of those two. And uh, it's the, the battle of the team. So I've just gotten a little bit further uh, into the track. And I think there's only a couple of minutes uh, left from here to the race finish. And uh, the guys are going to come right in a second. We have also a little bit of track right here where the guys come from here and go down and fun descent and uh, yeah it's even though it's, it has rained a lot I would say it's s still pretty pretty gravy and uh, I had uh, one lap in the start as a warm-up lap it's a uh, and uh, what's called unusual experience for me to stand on the sidelines and not to be in the race itself but I'm gonna actually do the next race of this series okay. It's so awkward talking to the camera and in front of all of these people. So let's skip forward to the guys. Godt så Gustav! Ja, Morten! Godt så er det en sprint nu. Det er fandme godt kørt lige et par minutter. Det er fandme godt kørt. Det er alt den Swift-træning. Det er godt kørt. Og så Jonathan lige det sidste. Ellers mega godt kæmpet. <laughs> So I'm actually on the race track right now, just trying to catch up Woo! with the boys before they are going. Oh my Jesus! I just about died. <laughs> oh, I'm just trying to catch up with the boys before the finish, so I can get a little bit of videos. But this descent is arguably one of my favorites in, yeah, I don't know, the whole country or, yeah, it's just all this perfect, I like these, uh, what's called, flowing sense oh, my arms, and it's just this flipping corner. 
Hvad siger du her? Post-race interview. Øhm, jamen, øhm, skal vi tage den på dansk, eller skal vi tage den på engelsk? Det er mere, mere arbejde for mig. Jeg kører øhm, rigtig godt. Det er et rigtig fint løb. Øhm, Og jeg der er ikke så meget at sige. Jeg har kørt. Det er, det er al den øh, bike cleaning, jeg har lavet, tror jeg. Jeg tror simpelthen, det er det. Ja. Så, øh, jeg har ikke været noget paniktræning overhovedet. Nej, øhm, ikke noget swift Det har alt sammen været planlagt. Ja. Øh, var det hårdt, ja. det på kontoret? Det, det, det var det, jeg, det, 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 jeg tænker. Så god stav! Godt kæmpet! Godt kæmpet! Interview, take one. Ja, øhm, det gik egentlig meget godt for mig. Jeg blev nummer 4, så øh, det var meget godt. Men øh, starten den var øh, rigtig, rigtig dårlig, fordi at, øh, det var bare en øh, lang bak op. Men øh, ellers så var sporet meget godt, og det gik godt. Ja, ja så altså, vi kunne jo ikke få et interview fra Jonathan, fordi han øh, har valgt at tage hjem. Ja. Han, han blev lidt sur over, at jeg tog ham, <laughs> øhm, og jeg ikke gad at trække. Jeg kan også godt se den. Den, den ligger selvfølgelig på mig, men, ja. øh, men øh, vi må håbe på, at hans dag stadigvæk er god. Og jeg ja. gerne vil gerne snakke med dig. Og jeg har ikke ondt i ryggen den her gang. Så det er jo noget nyt. Alright. Ja. Så nu er vi klar til en masse svøfttræning, så ja. vi tager dem alle i Svendborg næste gang. Ja. Det gør jeg. Og der er jeg også med. <laughs> ja. <laughs> Lækkert. So uh, that was the last race of the season for the boys. And I think they've done really well and uh, unfortunately so uh, as i was trying to say right before i came home when the gopro died i think that gustav did a very good job of pushing himself today he didn't have the best best legs and uh, maybe it was because the the first hill where he just uh, went all out and and got such a big such a big advantage on the rest of the field but yeah really good really good ride and uh, for the other guys jonathan and Morten, unfortunately, Jonathan didn't seem to have the best day either, but uh, yeah, that uh, couldn't really say the same about Morten. Morten got over every, uh, yeah, he was just way faster than uh, everybody expected today, so uh, that was that was great, and I think that will really motivate him up for next year when uh, we do some push training and just training in general to get them uh, to be as fast as possible. So. Yeah, that was really great to see the guys today and be on the sideline and film a little bit and uh, show how good they are and how good they are becoming as uh, young riders. So that was really great to see and uh, I got a little ride out of it and uh, I got uh, driven to the uh, to the uh, to the race and just went around there and just uh, rode the way back. So that was 51 kilometers. My plan was to hit 70, but it is like one degree Celsius. So one degree over freezing for those who don't use Celsius. And uh, yeah, my feet are freezing. So uh, I will just get in now. So thanks for watching and um, yeah, I will see you in the next normal race report where I will actually race myself together with the boys. So see you.